Hey, what's going on guys? It's ETA Prime back here again. Today I wanted to show off two really awesome emulation station themes for your Raspberry Pi running RetroPie. Both of these themes that I'm about to show you are by a developer named Sarah Cade and she's done an amazing job with these. The first one here is finished. The second one I'm gonna show you is actually a one-off custom she did and it's not completely finished, but I wanna bug her to get it finished because I really like it. And I have a six-year-old daughter who loves playing retro games. You'll get the idea when I show you the next one. But first up, I want to show you my favorite theme as of right now. This is SPC 720. It has been out for a while, but I recently enabled it on pretty much all of my setups because it's just so smooth. She did update it from the original release. And I think this is one of the best emulation station themes out there. Just looks great. It's very smooth. We're going to go in here. It's super easy to enable. Um, all you're going to need to do is go to the RetroPie menu. Got a lot of systems on this one. ES Themes and find Sarah Cade SVC 720. It should be located near the bottom. New themes are always added to the ES Themes menu. So if you're searching for this in the future, you might just have to look for it. It's Sarah Cade SVC 720. Really nice theme here. Got a lot of systems in here. We'll just go into Super Nintendo. Does support videos, as you can see. And it's just super clean. And it's really fast. I recently did a video on a 10-inch Raspberry Pi tablet. I did show this theme off, and I really didn't mention it. A lot of people asked me about it, so I figured I'd go ahead and show it off in a video. Because I really like it. Got some Game & Watch here. Now I don't have any video snaps for Game & Watch. Game Gear. Some of my stuff's missing. But it's just a really, really clean theme. Now the next theme I'm going to show you is also by Sarah Cade. She built it for a friend, so it's pretty much a one-off custom, but I want to bug her enough to get this thing finished. I really do like it. It's not on the ES Themes menu. You will have to install it manually if you want to use it like it is. It's called Pink. Now I have a six-year-old daughter. I did show her this theme and she fell in love with it. So I got to get something going like this for her. And here it is. This is called Pink. I mean, it's definitely geared towards the little girls who love this kind of stuff. My daughter being one of those. She's six years old. She's really into Sailor Moon. She loves Kirby and the Powerpuff Girls, so this is perfect for her. I showed her this earlier, and she kind of freaked out about it. Now, not everything's finished, as you can see. This was a one-off custom for somebody. There was a lot of collections in here, like Kirby and Barbie and things like that, and I don't have those added. But hopefully, in the future, if she's not too busy, she can finish this up, because I think it's really awesome. Now, my daughter loves playing retro games by herself and with me. I do have a Raspberry Pi set up in her room with a bunch of games on it, but she saw this, she loves it, and she definitely wants to get something like this set up on her system. Now, Neo Geo Pocket, Neo Geo Pocket Color, PlayStation Portable. But we go through here, and there's a lot of stuff missing because, like I mentioned, it was a one-off. Retro Pi. I think it's beautiful. My daughter loves it. And I hope Sarah Cade can finish this one day because it's just really awesome. So that's it for this video, guys. I really appreciate you watching. I really wanted to show off this SPC 720 theme here because this is what I've been using on pretty much all of my setups lately. I also wanted to showcase the pink theme just to see how many people are really interested in it. Please let me know in the comments below. We might be able to get some steam rolling here and get Sarah Cade to finish it up. Really appreciate you guys watching. I'm going to leave a link to her YouTube channel down below. I'll also have some other links if she approves of it. And like always... Thanks for watching.